Back in this country, there's a battle brewing over changes the Harper government is making to the Elections Act, and the man leading the charge is the head of Elections Canada. Mark Mayrand is his name, and he says all the changes the Tories are making will disenfranchise thousands of Canadians and create an unfair system. Vashi Capellos has the story. The bill that we're bringing forward... The You'd be hard-pressed to find a more controversial piece of proposed legislation this year than the Fair Elections Act. Critics say it's anything but. The only reason they're doing this is to stack the deck for the next election. The crux of the criticism is that the act won't do anything to get out the vote and could even hurt it. People will no longer be able to use vouching to vote. That's when someone else vouches for your identity because you don't have ID. And the chief electoral officer will no longer be able to even talk about why to vote, just how and where. My biggest concern is that at the end of the day, Canadians will be denied the right to vote. The concern comes at a time when less and less people are voting. Just 39% of eligible youth voters cast a ballot in the last election. Imagine if we only had 39% of young people graduating from high school, it would be considered a crisis. Um, so I think you know, overall, we could definitely strengthen the act if we did more to focus on how we could encourage and motivate more turnout. Students make up a large portion of the estimated 120,000 people who used vouching in 2011. So do seniors and the disabled. Adam Shedletsky started a petition to convince Ottawa to rethink the changes at the ballot box. 56,000 people have signed it. Canadians are suspicious, and rightly so in this circumstance. But the government says there's no reason to be. Not only would the act strengthen penalties against people who violate elections laws, but the government says doing away with vouching is all in an effort to eliminate the possibility of fraud. And the Conservatives say that possibility is there. 50,000 such irregularities in the last election related to vouching according to Elections Canada's own report. But it's falling on deaf ears. The opposition says the Conservatives are just trying to marginalize people who wouldn't have voted for them in the first place. This wouldn't have been done if not for the fact that this will benefit the Conservatives. Vashi Capellos, Global News, Ottawa.